Hello everyone, I'm Andy Raphael from eTechnics.com and I'm here with Tim from Gigabyte. And um, we're just looking at some of the, uh, the new stuff that's coming out on the market and uh, really, take it away. So this is an all-in-one PC, but what makes it special is that it is a DIY system. So you can build this yourself by buying the individual components through your normal uh, retail, retail channels. So this is what it looks like inside. You can see the motherboard is over there. This is a special low profile cooler. It's available actually from Intel, but this particular one uh, comes with this chassis. This is a MyTech chassis. So when you buy the chassis, you get the chassis, the cooler, and uh, the power supply, which is over here. It's a power brick. Now, what makes this possible is a very low profile, thin mini ITX motherboard. And you can see it looks like a normal motherboard. It's got CPU, SODIMM memory, and then all the connectivity that you would normally expect, like uh, HDMI, display port out, USB 3. Uh, it also has LVDS, which is the monitor connector that allows this touch screen over here. Now, Gigabyte has made this motherboard particularly special because it allows for 19 volt, which is the Intel Thin Mini ITX spec, um, and it also has 12 volt, a 12 volt option. So that opens up the industrial PC market to us. So this will be available through our normal distribution channels as well as all the other all-in-one system components. So if you're interested in all-in-one, look for this logo. It's Intel's all-in-one certification logo. And these are the two retail packages that will tell you that we have two, two motherboards, two thin mini ITX motherboards. One is based on the B75 chipset, so this targets businesses, small businesses. And the H77, which will target like home PCs. Okay. So uh, at the moment, obviously, it's just been Intel who have really sort of jumped on this uh, yeah. thin. Uh, but you know, it is great to see the brand starting to pick it up, and Gigabyte being Gigabyte out the first. So uh, that's great news, and uh, I expect this is going to be huge because uh, everyone at the moment is talking about DIY sort of yeah. dying a little bit. This just proves it's clearly yeah. not. Oh, I want to add one thing, if yeah. I may. Yeah. This uh, CPU cooler can cool any CPU that is 65 watts or lower. So that is an Ivy Bridge Core i7. Yeah. This is by no means uh, a low spec system, very yeah. high spec. Yeah. 3770K, yeah. no problem, even no problem. something that is so small. Uh, it's just simply amazing. Uh, I can't believe some of the stuff that we're actually seeing here with Gigabyte, how they've managed to harness all this performance, all this power into something so small. Uh, it just goes to show. Keep checking back for all of our uh, CES footage uh, while we're here in Las Vegas.